Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new here. Thank you for joining me for another practice today. Today we're gonna go through just a strong yet steady vinyasa practice. Great for the morning, but equally great for any time of the day. Um, so if you would like to use any props, grab them. If you'd like to play any music, put it on. And we're gonna start today in a child's pose. So come on over onto your mat. Bring your big toes together, bring your knees nice and wide, all knees can be together. Just push the bottom onto the heels, walk the arms forwards and just let the forehead rest onto the ground. And once you're there, just take a moment to settle in. So softening through the shoulders, softening through the arms, the fingertips. Take a moment to just feel a sense of release come over the body. And then just begin to tune into the breath. Begin to take the unconscious breath, the breath that we go through our day using, into a conscious breath. And as you begin to develop the breath, see if you can go back to the deep belly breath. So as you're inhaling, you're breathing into the belly, all the way up into the chest, the heart, the lungs. And as you're exhaling, you're emptying the chest, the belly, until there's no breath left in the body. And as you're beginning to deepen the breath in the front of the body, See if you can also send the breath into the lower, middle and upper back. So you're really using the whole body, the whole lungs to nourish each and every cell. Lovely, and then from this position, just begin to make your child's pose a little bit more active. So begin to really walk the arms as far forward as you can. Maybe you lift the elbows and the forearms. Maybe you even pop up onto the fingertips. Just press the chest down, feel the openness across the armpits and the shoulders. And then together here, let's seal the lips, take a really big breath in. And a big sigh, just let it go. <sighs> Lovely. And then place the palms flat. Inhale, look between the thumbs. Let's rise all the way up to our tabletop. Bring the knees underneath the hips, hands underneath the shoulders. Good. And let's just jump straight into movement. Let's waken up through the body. So as you inhale, drop the belly, lift the chin. Simple cow pose, open up across the chest. And then exhale to round the spine, chin to chest, tuck the tailbone. Again, inhale to drop the belly, lift the chin, lift the chest. Exhale to round the spine, chin to chest. And then just continue for a few more rounds in your own time with your own breath. And then as you begin to move here, take any other movements that feel natural. So maybe you're circling through the hips, maybe you're going in a figure of eight, maybe the upper body gets involved, the shoulders and the chest. Just move around in any way that you need to, to just loosen any nooks and crannies, getting into any tight spots, just do what feels good for you. Beautiful. And then when you're ready, come back to tabletop position. Keep the knees underneath the hips exactly as they are. Just the upper body. We're going to walk the hands forwards. Come down into our puppy pose. Draw the foreheads to the ground. Let the chest open. Let the shoulders stretch wide. You can stay here if you'd like to deepen it. Pop up onto the fingertips if you'd like to deepen it further. Maybe the chin and the chest even come down onto the ground. Wherever you are, just breathing in and breathing out. Mm. 
Lovely, and then inhale, lift the gaze. Walk the hands all the way back into your tabletop position. From here, spread the fingers wide, tuck your toes under as you inhale, and then exhale, lift your hips up and back, come into your first downward dog. And then same as your tabletop position, just begin to move around right away, taking any movements that feel good, just loosen up, waking up through the physical body. Beautiful, and then when you've had enough of that, let's find stillness. Feet about hip distance apart, spread your fingers, press into each and every fingertip. Good, now from here, let's inhale, lift high onto the tippy toes. Wave the body forwards, rounding through the upper back, coming into high plank. And then as you exhale, look forwards, little bends in the knees, we're waving all the way back into downward dog. So think of it like a wave-like motion. Let's move with the breath, inhale, wave forwards, really press through the hands, try to open the shoulder blades. Exhale, look forwards, push the bottom back into your downward dog. Again, inhale, wave it forwards, come to high plank. Exhale, drop the belly, look up, lift it back. One more time, inhale, wave forwards, come to high plank. Now this time as you exhale, drop the knees lower all the way onto your belly. Good, from here, I'm just going to remove my mic. From here, place the hands either side of your hips, engage through the belly, engage through the bum. Take an inhale, lift into cobra, shoulders draw back, chest draws forward, you're opening across the throat. As you exhale, lower all the way back to the floor. Again, inhale to cobra, lift up, open the chest. Exhale, slowly back down. One more time, inhale, lift up, open the throat. And then exhale, push to the knees, tuck your toes, hips up and back into your downward facing dog. Take a nice deep inhale. And exhale. Lovely. On your inhale, sweep the right leg to the sky. Point the right toe, relax the left heel. As you exhale, just bend the right knee, open up across the hip. Really press through both hands and see if you can just lift the left armpit slightly. So you're kind of squaring the chest towards the back of the room. Take a nice inhale here. And then exhale, look forward, step the right foot forward between the hands. Pop up onto the fingertips, come into a runner's lunge. Think again about lengthening through the spine. So as we inhale, we're driving the heart forwards, sinking into the left hip flexor, opening across the throat. And then as we exhale, let's straighten that right leg, bow down, folding over the right leg into this extended pyramid shape. Beautiful, twice more like that. Let's inhale, bend the right knee, lift open into the hip flexors. Exhale, straighten the leg as you fold. Inhale, bend the knee, open up. Exhale, straighten the leg as you fold. Beautiful, inhale, come back to your runner's lunge. Exhale, place the hands down, step back into high plank position. Take an inhale as you press into the palms, open the shoulder blades. And then exhale, knees up or down, slowly lower all the way to the belly. Untuck your toes. This time, let's interlace the fingers behind the lower back. As you inhale, lift the fist, the chin and the chest up. And as you exhale, squeeze the thighs, lift the legs off the floor into this locust shape. Take a nice inhale, lift higher. And an exhale, just hold it there. Take one more inhale. And then exhale, slowly lower all the way back down. Bring the hands underneath the shoulders. Inhale into your cobra, maybe a little bit higher this time. And then exhale, tuck your toes, lift your hips into downward facing dog. Take a nice inhale here. And exhale. 
Inhale, sweep the left leg to the sky, point the toe. Exhale, bend the knee, open up across the hip. Again, see if you can relax the right heel down. See if you can lift the left armpit slightly so you're really squaring the chest towards the front. Take a really big breath in as you press the mat away. And then exhale, left foot steps forwards between the hands. Pop up onto the fingertips. Inhale, chest forwards, heart lifts, open the throat. Exhale, straighten the left leg, fold it down over that left thigh. Inhale, bend the left knee, follow the breath as you drive the heart through. Exhale, straighten the leg and fold. One more time, bend the left knee, chest forwards, open up. And then exhale, straighten the leg, fold it down. This time, inhale, bend the left knee, palms come flat. And then exhale, step back into your high plank. Take a deep inhale in plank. And then exhale, lower down, knees up or down to the belly. Nice and traditional this time, inhale, cobra, if you can, high cobra, beginning to lengthen the arms a little bit more. Exhale, tuck your toes, lift the hips back into downward dog. Inhale through the nose. And exhale, let it go. Inhale, lift the heels, look forwards. Exhale, begin to walk the feet all the way to the hands. Inhale, lengthen the spine, hands to shins, lift the chest. Exhale, forward fold, leg, head draws towards the thighs. Inhale, stand up, reach the arms all the way up, press the palms to the sky. And then exhale, bring your hands to your heart. Release your arms next to your hips. Lovely. Find your mountain pose. Palms face forward, shoulders back. And as we move into the flow, just remember to add in what you want to add in. Take away what you want to take away. And just modify, skip things out as much as you need to. When you're ready, let's inhale, circle the arms to the sky. Look to the thumbs. Exhale, forward fold, hands down, nose to knee. Inhale to flat back, hands to floor, shins or thighs. Exhale, hands down, step if you're ready, jump back to plank, lower either chaturanga or the floor. Inhaling, upward facing or cobra. Exhaling to downward facing dog. Take a deep breath in. And a deep breath out. And inhale, lift your heels, look forwards. Exhale, bend the knees, step or hop the feet between the hands. Lengthen on the inhale, flat back. Fold on the exhale, nose to knee. Inhale, circle the arms all the way up, press the palms to the sky. Exhale, fold right back down, forward fold, really engage the belly, fold yourself in half. Inhale to lengthen, look up. Exhale, step or jump back, lower down, maybe you're landing in Chaturanga. Inhaling, cobra or upward facing, your choice. Exhaling to downward facing dog. Take a nice deep inhale. And exhale. Inhale, lift your heels, look up. Exhale, bend the knees, step or hop the feet between the hands. Lengthen on the inhale. Fold on the exhale. Inhale, circle the arms all the way up, squeeze the inner thighs, look up. Exhale, one more, forward fold, hands down, nose to knee. Inhale to flat back, lengthen. Exhale, step or jump back, lower down, chaturanga or the floor. Inhaling, upward facing or cobra. Exhaling to downward facing dog. Take a deep breath in. And a deep breath out. Inhale, lift the heels, look up. Exhale, bend knees, step or hop the feet between the hands. Lengthen on the inhale. 
fold on the exhale. This time straight to chair pose, bend the knees, inhale, Utkatasana, reach the arms up. Exhale, just sit down into it, begin to squeeze the inner thighs together, zip the belly muscles in. Take another inhale here. And then as you exhale, cactus the elbows left to right, squeeze the shoulder blades together as you open up across the chest. Lovely, and then inhale, straighten both arms and the legs. Exhale, forward fold, hands down, nose to knee. Inhale to flat back. Exhale, either down dog or vinyasa, step or jump back, lower with control. Inhaling to upward facing or cobra. Exhaling to downward facing dog. Take a nice inhale here and let it go. Lovely, let's inhale, sweep the right leg high. As you exhale, draw the right knee to the right elbow. So really high, really wide, really press the earth away. Inhale, right leg lifts high. Exhale, right leg to right, uh, sorry, to left elbow. So you're twisting it across the body again, pressing the earth away. Inhale, right leg high. Exhale, draw the knee to the nose, round the upper back, squeeze it in. And then step the right foot forward between the hands. Lovely, turn the back heel flat. Inhale to warrior two, so cartwheel the arms right up. And then exhale, bend into your warrior two. Few moments here just to settle in. Come back to the breath if you've lost it and just really think about grounding down through the feet. Breathing in. Breathing out. Can you bend a little deeper into the front knee to open the hips? Inhaling. Exhaling. Lovely. And then let's inhale, straighten the front leg, flip the front palm, reverse your triangle, left arm down the left leg, right arm reaches up and over. Feel the side body stretch for a few moments. Big breath in here. And then exhale, rise all the way up, lean forwards, 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 triangle pose, right hand down, left arm to the sky, you're turning open through the chest. And see if you can avoid placing all the weight into that right hand, see if you can use your core by just bringing the back of the hand lightly against the shin. Open the chest, inhale, and exhale. One more inhale, exhale, look down, bring the left hand to the hip, bend the right knee, right hand's going to come to the right corner of the mat or a block and we're going to lift the left leg into half moon pose. Once you get there, turn the chest to the left, option to keep the left hand there, otherwise left arm to the sky. And then see if, if you're balanced or familiar with the pose, you can lessen the load on the right hand. So you're really trying to let the right hand be really light, maybe it even hovers off the floor. Breathing in. Breathing out. Inhaling. And exhaling, lovely. From here, inhale, bring the right hand towards the right big toe. Bend the right knee and then very, very slowly step the left foot to the back of the mat. Inhale, turn the chest, you're in extended side angle pose. Exhale, left arm reaches forwards over the air. If this is too much, just bring the right forearm to the thigh. Left arm can even stay reaching up towards the sky. Make it work for you. Bend into it wherever you are. Breath in. Breath out. Inhaling. And exhaling. Lovely. On an inhale, take that left arm to the sky. Exhale, look down. Left hand comes to the floor. Pick up your left heel as you inhale, the right arm lifts up into your easy twist. And then exhale, pivot onto the little toe edge of the left foot. Step the right foot back into side plank. You're either going to stack the feet, otherwise place the right foot on the floor in the centre of the mat for some support. 
Otherwise, see if you can lift the right leg off, really firing up through the thighs and the bum a little bit more. Wherever you are, press through the left hand as you inhale. Exhale, lift the hips. Inhale, reach higher. And exhale, last inhale here. And then exhale, right hand down, right toes down, down dog or lower chaturanga. Inhaling to upward facing, exhaling to downward facing dog. Take a big inhale through the nose. And exhale, let it go. And inhale, sweep the left leg to the sky. Exhale, left knee, left elbow, squeeze it high, squeeze it wide. Inhale, left leg lifts up. Exhale, left knee, right elbow, twist it across the body. Inhale, left leg high. Exhale, knee to nose, round the upper back. And then step the left foot forward between the hands. Turn the back heel flat. Inhale, warrior two, rise all the way up. And exhale, bend into it. Three breaths here, just settle in. Inhaling. And exhaling, slow the breath down. Maybe you're breathing with sound. Inhaling. Exhaling. Inhaling and exhaling really really nice let's flip the front palm straighten the left leg inhale reverse your triangle really reach that left arm up and back find that side body stretch just one big inhale here and then exhale rise all the way up and over into triangle pose left hand down right arm to the sky turn the chest press through the feet inhaling Exhaling, inhaling, and exhaling. You have one more inhale. Exhale, look down, bend the left knee, a block there if you need it, otherwise left hand to the corner, lift the right leg up and open the chest. Maybe again you're lessening the load on the left hand by coming onto the fingertips. Maybe three fingers, two fingers, one finger, maybe the hand hovers. Breathe in, breathe out. Can you expand in every direction? Inhale, exhale, lovely. And then inhale, left fingertips come to the big toe edge of the left foot. Exhale, bend the left knee, very slowly step the right foot to the back of the mat. Side angle pose, right, uh, right arm lifts up, inhale, turn the chest. Exhale, stay there or reach the right arm forwards. Left forearm can always be on the left thigh, breathing in, breathing out, inhaling, exhaling, lovely. On an inhale, right arm lifts up. Exhale, right hand to the floor, pick up the right heel. Inhale, left arm to the sky, open the chest. Exhale, side plank, your variation. Left foot steps back in the centre or maybe again, you lift the left leg off the right leg. Flex the feet, maybe you're challenging your balance by gazing up. Inhaling. Exhaling. One more inhale, and then exhale, left hand down, left toes down, down dog or lower through your vinyasa. Inhaling to upward facing or cobra, exhaling to downward facing dog. Take a deep breath in here, and a big sigh, let it go. Inhale, lift your heels, look up. Exhale, bend the knees, walk, step, hop to the front of the mat. Inhale to lengthen. Exhale to fold. Bend the knees, inhale, chair pose, reach the arms all the way up. 
Exhale, cactus the elbow, squeeze the shoulder blades last like this. Inhale, straighten the arms and the legs reach up. Exhale, forward fold over the legs, nose to knee. Inhale to flat back, lengthen. Exhale, step or jump back, lower down, either chaturanga or skip, your choice. Inhaling into your back bend if you're moving there. And then exhale, we meet in our downward facing dog. Big breath in. Big breath out. Lovely. Let's inhale, sweep the right leg to the sky. Exhale, right knee, right elbow, high and wide. Inhale, right leg lifts. Exhale to the left, high and wide, squeeze it high. Inhale to the sky. Exhale to the nose. And then step the foot between the hands. Turn the back heel flat. Inhale, warrior two. Exhale, just settle in. Option to stay with the, with the same as we did last time. Otherwise, this time take your left hand, wrap it behind the lower back into a half bind. Maybe you can bring the fingertips to grab hold of the right inner thigh. Now we're gonna keep the bind as we inhale, straighten the front leg, reverse the triangle, reach the left, right arm up and back. And then exhale, reach the right arm forwards, come into your half bound triangle pose. Turn the chest, use the binds to open across that left shoulder. Breathing in and breathing out. Lovely, inhale, look down. Keep the bind if you can. Exhale, right hand to the corner or a block. Lift into your bound or half bound half moon, a bit of a tongue twister. Open up and try again to open that left shoulder towards the sky. Breathing in. Breathing out. One more inhale. Exhale, slowly bend the right knee, step the left foot back. Place the right hand to the big toe edge of the foot and then inhale, turn the chest into your half bound side angle. Squeezing across the belly, across the bum, inhaling. Exhaling. Inhale and exhale. Nice guys, as you inhale, lift that left arm to the sky. Exhale, left hand to the floor. Pick up the left heel, inhale, right arm lifts up. Now this time as you exhale, go to side plank. Keep the, right, the left shoulder over the right wrist, bend the right knee, place the ball of the foot behind you. And then inhale, open into your wild thing. Squeeze the glutes, let the head hang heavy, breath in and out. One more inhale and then exhale, right hand down, right toes down, down dog or lower through your vinyasa. Inhaling to upward facing, exhaling to downward facing dog. Good, breathe in and breathe out. We have one more side like this to go. So let's inhale the left leg to the sky. Exhale, left knee, left elbow, really super high. Inhale, left leg high. Exhale to the right, twisting across the body. Inhale, left leg high. Exhale to the nose, round the upper back and then step the left foot forwards. Turn the back heel flat, inhale, warrior two. Exhale, settle in. This time, right arm wraps behind, lower back or the left inner thigh if you can get there. Flip the left hand, inhale, reverse your triangle. And then exhale, triangle pose, left hand down. Turn the chest, right shoulder opens to the sky. Breathing in, keep pressing through the feet. Breathing out. Inhaling. And exhaling. Lovely. On an inhale, look down. 
exhale bends the left knee if you can keep the bind left hand to the corner lift the right leg up as you open across the chest flex the feet really press through both through the left standing leg again maybe you're light on that left hand inhale and exhale one more inhale very very slowly exhale bend the left knee right foot steps to the back of the mat left hands to the big toe edge of the foot and then turn the chest into your half bound side angle really bend into it inhale and exhale inhaling exhaling on an inhale right arm lifts up exhale right hands to the floor inhale left arm to the sky exhale side plank keep the shape in the upper body just bend to the left elbow ball of the foot behind you and then inhale open into wild thing really really let the head hang heavy just feel good yoga pose breath in breath out one more inhale and then exhale left hand down plank pose down dog or lower chaturanga inhaling to upward facing exhaling to downward facing dog take a deep breath in and a big sigh let it go inhale sweep the right leg to the sky exhale step the right foot to the outside of the right hand lizard lunge draw the chest forwards just find a moment here just wiggle your way into it move forwards backwards forwards backwards beautiful and then from there let's turn the back heel flat option one again traditional side angle option two half bind option three thread the right shoulder under find your full bind grabbing the left fingertips and the right fingertips if you're there we're working on grabbing the left wrist with the right hand once you're there begin to straighten the left arm turn the chest breath in breath out inhaling and exhaling lovely one more inhale exhale look down whether you're in a bind or not everyone step the left foot forward it might need to be one it might be one big hop it might be lots of little ones come onto the right tippy toes keep your bind if you have it otherwise hold the back of the right thigh with the right hand look forward press into the left foot inhale stand up into your bird of paradise you are just focusing on drawing the hips forwards, the crown of the head to the sky. If you can, begin to straighten the left leg. If not, you're just holding the right thigh, opening the right leg to the right. You're just working on the balance wherever you are. Breathing in. Breathing out. One more inhale very slowly exhale everyone place that right foot down like it's really really delicate nice and gently step the left foot to the back of the room release the hands down to the floor and then drop the back knee to the mat big inhale reach the arms up and jelly asana just one big in breath and then exhale hands down step back to plank down dog or lower chaturanga inhaling to cobra or upward exhaling to downward facing dog take a big breath in big breath out inhale the left leg high exhale step the left foot to the outside of the left hand pop up onto the fingertips draw the chest forwards lizard lunge and again just a little moment to rock forwards and backwards Good. And then from there, again, we're going to turn the back heel flat. Left palm down. Inhale, right arm lifts to the sky. Option one, stay. Option two, half bind. 
option three, left shoulder under the left knee, full bind, you're grabbing the fingertips, or maybe the left hand holds the right wrist. Begin to straighten the arm as much as you can as you turn the chest to the sky in whichever variation you're in. Breathing in, really bend into it. Breathing out, inhaling, and exhaling. Lovely, inhale, look down. Whether you've got the bind or not, we're gonna step the right foot to the front of the mat. Take your time to get there. Come onto the left tippy toes, look forwards. Remember if you're not binding, you're holding the outer left thigh. Press into the right foot, stand up wherever you are, opening into your standing balance. Left leg draws open to the left, right leg is strong and straight, crown of the head draws to the sky. And again, you stay there or you begin to straighten that left leg. Whatever feels good, breath in, breath out. One more inhale. And then very slowly again, like it's really super delicate, lower the left foot back to the floor. Step the right foot back to the back of the mat. Release the arms down and then drop the back knee to the mat. Inhale, Anjaniasana, arms to the sky, look up. Exhale, hands down, step back and lower through your vinyasa. Inhaling to upward facing, exhaling to downward facing dog. Take a deep breath in here. And then exhale, drop the knees, push the bottom to the heels, come into a child's pose and just let all of that hard work go. Maybe you take the arms now either side of your hips and let the forehead just rest, let the arms and the shoulders just rest. Beautiful, and then slowly, when you feel that the breath is nice and steady again, just tuck the chin, come all the way up to a kneeling position. Beautiful, just turn to face you. From here, inhale, reach your arms forwards. Take your right arm, thread it underneath the left arm, find eagle arms, palms together or backs of the palms together, your choice. Take an inhale, lift the elbows up, open across the chest. Exhale, draw the elbows forwards, just find that stretch through the back shoulder blades. Take another inhale here. And then as you exhale, bring the elbows towards the belly button, round the upper back, draw the chin to the chest. Good, just stay low, take an inhale. And an exhale. And then inhale, bring yourself back to centre. And then exhale, release the arms. Beautiful. Inhale, reach the arms forwards. Left arm wraps under the right arm. Thread the elbows, palms or backs of the palms. Draw the elbows forwards and up. And again, just really feel that stretch through the upper back. Good. Inhale, lift the elbows higher. Nice, and then on your next exhale, slowly draw the elbows towards the knees, round the upper back, draw the chin to the chest, big inhale, big exhale. Inhale, come all the way back to centre, and then exhale, release the arms, give the arms a little bit of a shake. Beautiful, from here just release the legs, come into a simple cross-legged position. Uh, right ankle in front of left or left ankle, whatever works. Hands onto the knees, grow tall through the spine. Let's take a deep breath in as we circle the arms up to the sky. As you exhale, bring your hands to your heart, shoulders relax. Let's do that again, inhale, sweep the arms up, follow the gaze, maybe lift the chin. Exhale, hands to the heart. One more time, inhale, sweep the arms up, look up. Exhale, bring the hands to the heart. This time, close the eyes, bow the chin towards the chest. 
Take another deep breath in through the nose. Exhale, sigh. Just take a moment to thank yourself for carving this time out. Thank your body for everything it's just allowed you to do. And thank you so much for sharing your energy and practice today with me. Well done everyone, thank you so much and I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up, leave me a comment below and let me know if there is anything else that you would like to see.